Step two builds on step one. When your cat is really comfortable with the new blanket you have been teaching for and feels very confident with getting on and is happy to settle, then we are ready to move that blanket into the open base of a carrier. We want to make it very comfortable and very open so that the cat doesn't feel enclosed or threatened. We use a similar technique with luring. So we use the cat's food in this situation and also petting, which she very much enjoys. And first we guide her in and then we feed her in position in the base of the carrier. You will see again that we are feeding and touching at the same time in the carrier, which this cat enjoys. And occasionally giving her opportunities to hop out so that there's no pressure to stay there and she gets to practice coming back in again with confidence. Gradually, we slow down the administration of the food. So to begin with, it's quite quick to build the behavior. We lure her into a sit and then a down and we keep on feeding. And then we might have that interspersed with more stroking or little gaps between the treats arriving so that we're building a longer term settle and really focusing on relaxation, calm, and there's no other show in town other than settling here in the base of your carrier. We always want to ensure that that carrier is really comfortable and that it's easy for your cat to get in and out of as well because sometimes we're dealing with young kittens who are agile and other times it's older cats who are not so much. So we want to make it very easy for them to be successful and to be able to settle and be physically comfortable as well as feeling emotionally safe.